zone. This is where oxygen, normal oxygen, O2 molecules, um, uh, take some energy, in this case from the lightning here, and form O3 molecules, ozone. Okay? This is actually a very important gas. This surrounds the upper part of our atmosphere and has very high energy um, particles of light come to the Earth. This reacts with the ozone or the oxygen here and can the air can absorb this and protect us from getting all this nasty energy from the sun. So it's a very, very important, this ozone that's formed here, but ozone is a form of oxygen. Well, I can demonstrate here with the fish tank the formation of ozone, O3. What I'm going to do now is pass an electrical current through the air before it gets to the fish tank and this is going to form some ozone. This ozonizer is used um, in fish tanks to help purify the water by getting rid of all the nasty things. Now, just as I switch this on, it's beginning to form some ozone, and I've added a dye in here that reacts with the ozone so we can see it. So this shows that ozone O3 is very, very different from oxygen O2. I mean, the oxygen has been bubbling through here throughout the lecture, and nothing changed color, only when I add some electricity to the air beforehand, which generates some O3, some ozone, do we see the color change. Okay, well, that's just about the end of the lecture. Um, 